What can you do to prevent flooding from happening in your home? 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jill Perkins joined a local plumber on a service call tonight to find out. The last thing Anthony Majori thought he'd be doing tonight would be hanging out with 7 Eyewitness News or Luke from Salino Plumbing. I have broken loose the clog and the sewer's now open. But with the constant rain we got today, his Cheektowaga home. This will be my sixth call today. One of many across western New York in need of a plumber. My wife come downstairs to get some popcorn off the shelf and she was like, don't eat a basement flooded. Salino Plumbing showing 7 Eyewitness News how they keep customers safe and dry. And what did you think the issue was again? Um, it, most likely just a lot of the rainwater. A lot of the sewer lines here are clay tile. Over here, they tend to shift, and they really just can't hold capacity of the water. Luckily for Anthony, his home didn't see much damage. Luke was able to fix the problem with what he called a mainline cleaning, a service that comes with a price tag of about $150 to $350. But if homeowners don't routinely pay attention to their sewer systems, you could be looking at a much higher cost. Replacing a sump pump could run you about $700. And if you need a new sewer, on average, that's three grand. So what can you do while your basement is still dry to protect Protect your home and your pocketbook? Uh, well, if you hear your toilets gurgling and you know it's about to rain, um, definitely get that checked out. You don't want to. You don't want to have your sewer already be backed up. A lot of times your sewer is actually already running slow. It already is backed up, and then when it starts to rain, it, it's it's going to overflow. Well, if you do notice that your sewer isn't working the right way and is starting to flood, check with your neighbors. If they're having the same problem, it might actually be the city or town line is broken, and you'll want to contact officials right away. Jill Perkins, 7 Eyewitness News. Thank